Good morning, everybody. We are headed to the Irene Stern Community Center, which is an early voting location here in Fort Bend County, which is a place that you can vote for Elizabeth Markowitz at. And um, to our team that was going to meet us out there, um, the route that Google Maps had planned for us is inaccessible, so it's sending us on a detour that added about <coughs> sorry five or six minutes, and so we're we're about ten minutes away. But we would love to see you if you have not yet voted in this first day of early voting for the House District 28 special election. Um, this is your chance, and you can go to any one of five early voting locations right now come out and meet us at irene stern community center which is 6920 katie fulcher road fulcher texas um, but you could also go to Bowie middle school cinco ranch branch library four corners community center and where we just were tompkins high school and um but eliz is going to be uh, at the Irene Stern Community Center right now. So that's that's the place to go if you have not yet voted and you want to meet the candidate. And uh, I know that she wants a chance to thank you. Um, and we want a chance to see all these people. We, we have just with uh, Powered by People and hundreds literally of volunteers from all over um, Katy and Fort Bend and Richmond and Fulcher and the unincorporated areas and Houston and then beyond, including El Paso, Austin, Dallas, uh, Longview, um, Nacogdoches, Christina, um, have all come in and knocked on doors, uh, more than 20,000 doors. And so we've met thousands of people and we want to be able to see you and thank you uh, for actually getting out there and voting on the first day of early voting. 7 a.m. to 7 p.m. today, tomorrow, Thursday, and Friday. Early voting, you can vote at any one of the five early voting locations. And then on next Tuesday, it's election day. So if you have not voted this week, you still have one last shot on election day. But why wait till election day? Get it out of the way today. That's what we say. The energy at Tompkins High with all the students and everybody that came out was really awesome. It's really cool. It was great to see Eliz up, <clears throat> up and at him super early. I mean, talk about energy. Um, and for those students to get a chance to meet her, uh, someone who is um, a big proponent of public education, someone who has been a public school educator, um, someone who is going to make this a focus of hers in the state legislature, to see that connection was pretty cool. We asked uh, a student, I think she was 16 years old, not old enough to vote, and said, you know, would you help us spread the word about Eliz? And uh, then asked her, what's, what's an issue that's important to you? And she said, gun violence. And uh, was really happy to know that Eliz is a candidate who, <clears throat> you know, understands this issue. She's a concealed carry license holder. Um, she's used firearms throughout her life responsibly. Um, she gets all that, but she also gets that we have to have universal background checks. We have to have extreme risk protection orders, previously known as red flag laws. Um, we have to be able to ensure that all loopholes are closed and she's drawn the connection between domestic abusers, domestic violence, family violence, and gun violence. And in Texas, we make it far too easy for um, domestic abusers, um, people who've harmed the people in their lives to purchase a firearm or to keep the firearm that they have. Uh, and um, she's going to change that. Jessica said she just voted. Sorry that she missed us. Oh, thank you, Jessica, for doing it. Thanks for getting out there. Every vote counts. We want to send uh, big love and respect to all of our friends in Virginia and uh, all the legislators in Virginia who are standing up to these um, thugs marching around in masks with AK-47s, AR-15s. Um, I saw a tweet by Patrick Dillon yesterday, and I think the essence of it was, um, you know, you don't have to shoot someone or kill someone to be a terrorist. Um, marching around with a weapon of war, with your face covered in an intimidating way, um, and, and doing so to try to force 
lawmakers to change their position, that's, to me, that's a form of terrorism. Uh, and, um, and yet you had these, these great young leaders from March for Our Lives. You had the Moms Demand um, Coalition. You had uh, the Giffords um, supporters. You had all these amazing grassroots advocates and volunteers literally standing up to them. And then you had these lawmakers who have the courage of their convictions and are going to do the right thing regardless of the intimidation brought to bear by these thugs. And that's what you are if, if you're um, you know, wearing a mask and, and wearing a, a weapon of war um, and, then, and then using that to try to intimidate lawmakers or everyday Americans. Call it what it is. All right, I'm now going to step off the soapbox, Cynthia, and enjoy the rest of this coffee. And, we have folks um, from all over um, that are saying hi, California and Phoenix and Virginia and just all over. And so thanks for, for tuning in. It's a beautiful morning here in Fort Bend County. We are on our way to go see Elis Markowitz, who is a candidate for the Texas State Legislature, House District 28. She's in a runoff to a special election. Historically, low voter turnout in these kind of deals. Um, we, along with hundreds of other Texans, have come to support Eliz, to knock on doors, um, to get people out to vote. And um, we now have a chance to thank those who are voting. And you can join us at the Irene Stern Community Center. Um, we were just at Tompkins High, bright and early, before the sun came up, or as the sun was coming up. Um, and this is our second of five stops today. We're going to each one of the five early voting locations in Fort Bend County on the first day of early voting. You care about climate change. You care about gun violence. You care about access to health care in the least insured state in the country. You care about the right of unions to organize. You care about the quality of public education and the support we give our public educators. You care about any of these things, then you care about this election and you care about Eliz Markowitz being able to win uh, on January 28th. And today, first day of early voting, is an important step towards that victory. So, if you live in Fort Bend County, please vote. If you do not, please support uh, Eliz Markowitz. You can go to her website, Eliz, number four, the letters TX.com, ElizforTexas.com. Uh, you can make a donation. You can find out more about her. You can also support our efforts uh, powered by people. We basically bring in uh, or help mobilize volunteers from across the country to support great candidates like you. And our website is poweredxpeople.org. So poweredbypeople.org. And thank you for those that are making donations to Powered by People. I see. Yeah, folks give them a are shout posting. out, Cynthia. Yeah. They're, I, I will do that, and um, I didn't catch some of your names, but thank you so much. And then we you know also, who you are. Yeah, you know it. And then we also have people from Puerto Rico, from Virginia, from Kentucky, from uh, Pennsylvania, I think, Bastrop, all over tuning in. So it is really great to have you guys all join us today on the first day of early voting for Dr. Eliz Markowitz and HD28. Thank you. This, this is a brand new subdivision, I think, because... The Google Maps aren't totally aligned, and we've taken this circuitous route, but I think maybe, just maybe, we're here. Are we still in Texas? Like this? <laughs> wow. This does not. It's not looking like. Interesting. Um, Uh-oh. <laughs> and that's the Google Maps? That's the Google oh, Map. Yeah. Oh, oh, no. no. All right. Somebody. Hold on, reboot. All right, we're gonna try it again. We're gonna try it again. Put it back in there. Up. Oh. Did it fix? Hey, if there are any Google engineers that are watching this right now, we had plugged in the Irene Stern Community Center and it took us to something that was not the Irene Stern Community Center. Now it is recalibrating and sending us five minutes away. So mm. you may just be able to watch us drive around lost <laughs> for the next half hour. Shout out to Atlanta. We have folks from Iowa. Yo. We have Massachusetts. Hey we there. Austin, Texas. Our um, friends in Austin. A lot of folks from Austin came down this weekend. Arizona. But there's some they're saying to use Waze. I don't I don't know about maybe Waze is a little bit better there, I think. 
There, look, can I show you this? Yeah. Check this out. Okay, Just, do you see this? Okay. Do you see how it's telling me to turn right here? Yeah. Okay, now look at where right would be. I'd have to go through that wall. Yeah, I don't know if that works, guys. All right. Colorado in the house, Orlando. Wow. Rock Wall, Texas. Tucson, Arizona. Tucson, Arizona? Kentucky. Mike from Kentucky says what? hi. Hey, Mike. Guess who's on? Kim Olson. Hey, Kim. Kim's running a, a really tough, really important race right now. We wish her all the luck. Um, but I wish us even more luck finding the Ironman story. <laughs> Christina from DC. I may just go back to Tompkins High School. <laughs> Abby, San Antonio. Amy, Round Rock. Uh oh, Betta's gonna ask. And Baytown in the house. Excuse me. I'm Let's looking for the works. Irene Stern Community Center. I don't, I'll tell you, it's at um, 6920 Katie Virginia, Fulcher Kyle. Road. Let's see if they can help us. Dallas, Texas. Well, Google Maps took us here, but I don't think we're anywhere <laughs> close to it. Yeah. No. Yeah, this is, there's only two in here that we have. I was thinking it's about so this neighborhood. A, this is all Cross Creek Ranch neighborhood. It shows it's about a mile from here. Okay. You're close, but. I'm gonna put, what's, what, are you using Apple Maps or? No, this a, is Google Maps. Okay. I'm gonna, I'm gonna put it back into my Google Maps and see. Yeah, Kate, I'm trying to think of how you would get there from here. You'd have to get out of this neighborhood. Okay. Yeah. So this it, is a new neighborhood, right? It is. That's, I don't growing. think it's... I this don't whole think section's them. all new. Some of this is about maybe eight years old. Or so. Okay. Yeah. So Thank you, you for the help. You're welcome. Here, there's a tall building here that's where you'll turn out. Okay. To the right. That, um, what's it called? Like a little observation room. Yeah. But you'll make a right there, and that'll take you to the main road, West yeah. Park Tollway. Thank you all so much. Really appreciate it. Okay. We're going to try again. Um... Folks are checking in from all over, but do they keep posting? We have um, Atlanta, Atlanta, Georgia, Frisco, Texas. Mm. We spent a lot of good time in Frisco, Texas. All right, Cynthia, I want you to now monologue for a little bit. Okay. Just give us your thoughts and reflections on this weekend. Okay. Uh, while I give this another shot. Okay, Beto is going to put it in. And um, you know what? I do not have... Ways I'm gonna make sure to download that. Um, and that I weigh, <laughs> I weighs. Uh, what, what, what if, um, but ways and Google are owned by the same people, no? I, I don't discuss, know. yeah. Well, we, we shall see. We're gonna figure this out. Um, if anybody is on <laughs> the live stream that's part <laughs> that's here and can send us a pin that is already at the irene community center please do oh that. yeah it says we're about a mile away okay um, all right Let's see if we make it guys i don't know um it keeps wanting us to you, you know back where it wanted us to take that right and i was like look you can't take a right yeah it's still wanting us to do that um hmm cabron uh oh whoop Let's just go this way. Let's see. Rockwall, Texas. Sorry, I, I missed some. You know what? Stuff. I'm gonna. This this is controversial. I'm gonna go to Apple Maps. Oh no! Yeah, yeah it's Apple, happening. Apple, you're doing yeah, it. It's okay. Happening. Here we go. Hi, Luther from San Antonio. Logan is on. Hi, Logan. Saw you last night. Come back. Oh, Sally's saying come back to FM 1463 to get here. Okay, Sally, let me just, um, let me just put this in. Let's see. Connell, you're making me nervous. I'm Run, sorry, talk, I'm sorry. Like, okay, like, yes. Uh, you're saying... Sorry, Sally, I know that you said you sent me a message, but I couldn't see. If you guys have a pin, that would work. Right. North Carolina. Hi, Ellen. Gina's going to see us at Cinco. All right, I think Hopefully I'm on to we'll something. Make it. I'm, I'm thinking I'm on to something. Seattle in the house. Hello, Seattle. 
Google Maps, you you may have just lost me to Apple Maps. Oh no! Uh, I, I, and no offense to wow. the Google people, but like, um, Denton. That, that was not good. Denton, Texas. Hi, Ruth. Yo, Denton. Our our friend Ruth is oh, watching. Oh, hey, uh -huh. Ruth. New York City. Ruth made us some cookies. She made us macaroon. What are they called? Macaroons. That sounds right. Yeah, I think yeah. that's right. And plus. Think. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Beto. All right. I Let's think see. we're going somewhere. And Chicago. Jax from Chicago. Turn right onto West Park and then turn on Katie Fulcher Road. This means nothing to me. I don't know. Like I'm now. <laughs> I'm now like five years into using uh, phone-based maps. So like road names, I just can follow the blue line. Like that's. Anise. All my orienting, orientating, how do you, what's, my, whatever. Yeah, uh, navigating. Yeah, all my navigating skills are, are lost. Yeah, Iowa, but this is, Iowa. Look at, look at that lake, that oh. little pond, the ducks. Look at that Puerto Rico. The get his exercise. Dallas. People from all over, I love it. Look, here, here's the deal. This is, it's a little bit Utah. of a division of labor. Eliz is at the Irene Stern Community Center right now. Go see her. We will keep you entertained <laughs> on your way via the live stream. We're just going to be driving around Fort Bend um, looking for this. Um, Perlin, somebody noticed this banana. I do not it's know. It's been there for yeah. about four days. It's and right here. It's, yep. It will get eaten at some point, hopefully. Almost had it. Uh, New York City. New York City. Yeah. New York City. We have, uh, I hope I'm saying this right, Manor, Texas. Manor? Manor, maybe? You know what's interesting? Oh, Chesterfield, wow, Virginia. Um, this is beautiful. This is a very, very beautiful neighborhood. But it's so new. Like, some of these roads that I'm passing do not show up on either the Google map or the Apple map. Louise. Uh, no, wait. Sorry, did I say that? But you know what? If you live in this area, you know exactly where the Irene Stern Community Center is. So I don't, I don't got to tell you. Louisiana, Missouri City. I'm trying to call out everybody. Look at how pretty that is. Can I just have some validation from anyone else who's tried to find the Irene Stern <laughs> Community Center and was lost? Or is it just me? It may be just me. Um, wow, it is a beautiful morning though. It really is. Huntington, New York. Huntington, yep. Luann, hi Luann. Come on Apple Maps, come through for us now. If ever you were. <laughs> All right, let's see. Hey, is there any way that we can get um, Eliz to um, live stream in with us? That may be too That's beyond technical. my skill yeah, set, okay. but too. I'll try that next time. I will have to learn how to do that. Ah, oh, Ted what? from El Paso. Oh, go ahead. El Paso, Virginia? I don't know if I'm reading that right. Scottsdale, Arizona, Arkansas. Okay, Beto, sorry I interrupted you. Go ahead. Oh, no, I was just uh, wanted to know if, if uh, what people are talking about on the live stream their questions are there I'd love to hear their comments what do you think about what's going on in Virginia what do you think about the rules for the impeachment trial um, what do you think about what's happening in this country right now let me see what they say we have Sue from South Australia Beto what saying hi yep. Sue tell us how things are in Australia we've been following the news um, with a lot of concern and um, you know I've, I've read that uh, as many as, um, you know, half a billion animals have, have been killed, uh, maybe more, um, perhaps entire species wiped out, um, obviously a threat to, to human life and, and property as well. Tell us what things look like in Australia right now. Do you Sue? say, is it down under? Is that out, I think? I think you can say that. Yeah. Gaga. Whoa. Did we miss it? Nope. No? Oh, uh... oh yes, early voting. <laughs> we found it. You know Beto. what? I'm an, I'm an Apple Maps did it. Uh, user for life now. <laughs> yes. Wow. That was like a, a, a what, 15 minute detour that yep. it took us to? Conley, Texas. 
No, the Colony, Texas. The Colony, Texas. Sorry, I do not have my glasses on. Uh, somebody said, I am worried about how truth isn't truth anymore. Yeah. You just gotta let that one sink I in. know. Just, yeah, I don't think there's any comment. Yep. Sarah. We are. Right? I'm so excited. Louisiana in the house. Go Louisiana. Home of the LSU Tigers. Oh yeah. Oh, Dr. Eliz Markowitz. There's a It Eliz was a big sign. sign? Yeah. You know we're getting close. Smithville. Um, thank you all for hanging on and we will get there. Oh, Shonda saying, I hope, Shonda uh, Parbu saying, I hope people can find this location. I think if you're from this community, you must know how to get here. And if you use Apple Maps. Yep. Yes. Okay, there they are. We made it. We made it. That's a good job. Oh, no. Good job. No. Um, but we made it. Oh, look, hey. you have somebody there wanting to say hi. <laughs> I'm gonna clean this map guy this sorry guys I think it's a little dirty there we go all right hi there hi, good morning I'm good how are you very well all right. I was worried I've been here for a while we could we got lost <laughs> did you come oh yes okay. ma'am the google maps was not working for oh, us so I know well this is kind of maybe not even on a google it, map I don't think right? it is no, I don't think it is I don't think so either. we got lost, got lost. Oh, let's see. Oh, there she so is there she nice is Dr. Eliz oh, Markowitz, folks, well. right there. Oh. Good morning, you. Chicago. Um, aquí tenemos Sandra. Que Hola, está Sandra. Aquí para votar y apoyar a Eliz Markowitz. Sí. Yo voy a um, escribir algo. Que padre, mi Sandra. Gracias por esperarnos. Gracias por estar aquí esta mañana. Muchas gracias a ustedes. Gracias por tener su tiempo para venir a visitar a la comunidad de Katie y Fullshare. Y muy agradecidos porque el señor Beto tiene muy buenos proyectos para la nación, que es lo que nos hace falta. Y nosotros yes. necesitamos gente como él. Ah, gracias. Es un y ejemplo. Oh. Es un ejemplo a seguir. Y la señorita Liz también. Oh. Gracias, gracias. Voy Qué a linda, muy amable. Aquí. Dios los bendiga siempre. Gracias. Ya Muchas tienen mucho gracias, esperando. Sandra. Sí. Sí. Un poquito. Mucho gusto. Ah, mucho gusto. Sí, muchas ¿Me gracias. ¿Me tomo una foto? Muchas gracias. Sí. ¿Le puedo tomar? Oh, oh, gracias. Déjeme tomar un foto. Ok. Ok. Ok, gracias. Una, dos, tres. ¿También quieres tomar un foto? Ahí está. Una, dos, tres. Perfecto, ahí está. Yes. Muchas gracias. 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 Por favor, compartir la información sobre ellos. Sí, gracias, sí. Gracias. 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 Igualmente. Gracias. Muchas gracias. Sí. Ánimo, no. Good morning. Good morning. I'm doing very well. Did you vote? And not yet, but I'm, I'm going to go. All right. And where, where are we right now? You know, I don't live. I don't live on Fisher. I drove out here because I knew you were going to be out here. And because I could have voted right next to my, my home. And I thought about going to Tompkins, but... I woke up too late. I was like, let me go catch, let me go over here. So I knew exactly where you were, but I'm not How did you find this place? We're doing a Apple Maps. picture. You used Thank Apple Maps? Thank you. Yeah, let me grab them Apple and then Maps. I'll pull them all there. Yeah, if you want to go take a photo, I don't want to well, keep No, no. You. But, but I did want to thank you because up until um, you um, were coming out and going up for election, I had never voted. And I'm 39. Wow. And, and so... You know, I finally realized, you know, I need to go out there and, and what you were saying meant so much to me and I just want to thank you. Oh, you I got really it. do. It, that it is just, so it nice. just inspired me to get out and go vote and, oh. and here I am. And so oh, I just want so to thank you. To so I've wow. been following you and I, and I hope you're the best. I really do. Oh, oh, I really so appreciate it. Yeah. And you're wearing the Apple yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, sweatshirt. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> here we go. Let's take a picture. Yeah, yeah. And then, let's see, one, two, three. Will you guys join us for a group picture over here? Of course. Oh, All yeah, right, of course. Come do on. it. Come on over. No pressure. That was really nice. Oh, thank you for saying that. Of course. 
Miss Elis? Thank you. You sure did. Tacos, all right. I think, I think we might need to get some yeah. All right, everybody get it together. We're going to do a group photos. So, you're going over there. You too. So great to see people. And here I'm wearing red, but it doesn't mean anything. All right. This is a really good looking group right here. Everybody ready? Here we go. On the count of three, we're going to say Eliz. One, two, three. Eliz! You guys got that beautiful sky behind you. Very nice. There you go. You're welcome. Thanks, guys. It's so good to see you. Yes, sir. You got it. Yes, sir. We're going to grab this picture, Betty. You ready? Oh, sure. Come on in. You got it. Let me get that sky in the back. One, two, three. Perfect. There we go. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you all for support. Thank you for coming. Thank you. I appreciate it. Oh, my God. I heard tacos, too, guys. I'm going to be looking for them. There we go, Dr. Eliz Markowitz. They're awesome. Thank you. Hey, y'all. It's early voting day one. So if you know anybody in HD28, send them out to the polls, 7 to 7. We've already hit two polls. Lots of excited voters. And uh looks like we're about to win this seat. Woohoo! All right. Love that. The sun is coming up. Ooh, sorry. You want me to grab that for you? Yes. Yes, sir. You did it? Yep, I sure can. Thank you. Uh, on the national stage. Oh, I was really hoping for you. Cheering for you. Oh, thank you. you. Yeah. You set a marker. Well, and oh, uh, yeah. that was the, the thing. I don't care what that. Yeah. We got well, it. We got it. I won't even say yeah, it. We I will. Yeah. And th this is all part of it. This will contribute to what we need to do to oh, stop yes. Trump. Oh, yes. I, I really believe that. Absolutely. That's part of why we're here. So get sure. Absolutely. Yeah. And get Mitch out of here. Hold on. We'll get out of here. One, two. No, you're great. I'm just going to grab their picture. We got it. There we go. Thanks. So thank you, you so like much for showing me. Yeah, appreciate it. Always do for you. I don't thank know. You. I'm not sure. Yes, thank you very much. Uh, thank saw you. you. Saw you in Cyprus when you were running for Senate. Oh, okay. So. Well, oh. thanks for coming out and supporting e Liz and voting today. Absolutely. Yeah. I think. I think putting your weight behind it will bring out a lot of voters. So. I sure hope so. Yeah. Oh, we're going to stay after it today. We're going to go to all the early voting locations. Um, then back home to El Paso, and then back here for the last day of early voting on Friday. Wow. So all of us do our own. Yeah, I'd probably have an extra one. Hold on, one sec. <laughs> get out of the way. Yeah, I'll get out of the way. It's warming up. The sun's coming out. How Isn't long? That great? Yeah, it is. Isn't that great? Yes, sir. Uh, yeah. How long have have you guys been out here this morning? Uh, this is our. Uh, Fifth, well, been here over five years now. Okay. And uh, absolutely love it. We're from Michigan, and uh, we have a son and daughter-in-law that lives right in Katy. So that's what motivated us to be down here, but we love it. Oh. I mean, where we live, uh, got trees in the back. Some people say it was uh, our pecan trees are 110 to 120 years old. got a blue one. A creek in the back. To match my pink one. It's wonderful. Sure so, is beautiful. It really is. Yeah. So we really enjoy it. Awesome. Let's see, he got you one? Did he get you? There we go. Folks right there, powered by people. And by the way, we're so proud of both of our candidates. And uh, Tick Beto, who was on national stage, and uh, he just really represented represented us so well and set the marker. And uh, we're just very fortunate and very glad to have him here. Thank you for saying that. Really nice of you. Has but we'll, 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 we'll do this and uh, yeah. Eliz is out there, I think, getting her signs up. Let me see. We added some signs, Dr. Markowitz. All right. I like that. I like that. And if you guys have not seen uh, Eliz's car, just got to take a look right there. And it's a mess inside. That's what happens when you're campaigning. See? Can I take a look? Totally. Look at that, guys. That's what happens. Your car becomes your office. 
when with you some water, are campaigning. Some clothes. Yeah, it's all in there just in case, right? Right, right. Yeah. How are you feeling today? You have been working nonstop. You have been just a fireball of energy. How are you feeling today? I'm feeling great. I mean, we're finally here, right? Yeah. All the work that we've done is going to culminate over the next four days before we take a break from voting <laughs> to go TV, right? Yeah. GeoTV. Yeah. Uh, to make sure that we can get the people who didn't early vote out to the polls on Tuesday. Yeah. It's going to be great. I love it. And just so super proud of you as a woman, you know, for me to see you stepping up and taking on, you know, this challenge is just very inspirational. Dr. Markowitz, and since I've known you coming out with Beto, I'm just very, very impressed and very grateful that you are doing this. It is a sacrifice. And I don't know if folks really understand unless you've been here and done this, you know, the time that it takes and putting yourself out there, you know, in front of everybody and trying to do what you think is right. And so Dr. Markowitz, I appreciate you and I'm grateful for you. Well, so. back at you, Cynthia. Uh, You've been so helpful and we couldn't do this without you. So please know that the people behind the camera too are extremely important. Uh, uh, so Cynthia, Beto, uh, all the powered by people folks who came down over the past few weekends. None of this would be possible without you. Uh, and just remember, that's who we're doing this for, for the people. That's right. Uh, so thanks, team. All right, here we go. We have these wonderful volunteers. I heard tacos. I don't know if you heard tacos. Yes, Somebody said tacos. they have tacos. All right. Might, gotta, might need to try one of those tacos. This was hard to find. Yeah, right. Thing took me into like a developing community. The same with thing. Roads that weren't existing. We had the same problem, and then we had to switch. Oh, look, look, look! You got somebody that's giving us a high five. That's awesome. <laughs> Woohoo! All right. Yay! Yay! Good job. Keep it up. So pretty. Yeah, ours did the same, and then we ended up having to go to Apple Maps. A little more enthusiastic. I don't know. A few more people coming. I said, give me the contract. I didn't say anything to anybody about it. You just go into the bathroom and that thing darts around. You could catch her in two days and make her a normal dog. I was thinking it's the process because I can also work that. And now here we are. In what I've been told is the most diverse county in America, yeah. so it's where really all the neighborhoods I've been to, it's really made me so, so proud because there's people from like all over the world. Folks yeah. who've been here for generations, oh, yeah. folks who just got here uh, uh, you know, a couple weeks ago. Uh, uh, our granddaughter and grandson, but he's way too to go to top. Uh, you know, so I just, the whole neighborhood, the whole school is so diverse. And her friends are a diverse group. And I'm sitting there so proud of her and proud. And, uh, the fact of where they live some of the mm -hmm. and the experience you're having. All right, folks, I am going to sign off. And once we go to our next stop, I will make sure to get the live stream going again. I'm going to show you once more the voting locations, just in case you don't know and you are in the Fort Bend area and you need to go out and vote. Here we go. These are the five early voting locations. Please make sure you guys come out. Beto and Eliz will be visiting all the five voting locations today. Would love to see you guys out. And thank you again for tuning in. I appreciate you guys.